Welcome. I'm recording this video in March of 2020, and there are probably a lot of people that are going to be going from working at an office to working at home. And in this video, I'm going to talk about setting up an Asus router with a guest network to keep your work stuff separate from your home stuff. So this Asus router is set up for uh, regular Wi-Fi internet access. So what you want to do is you want to go to guest network over here on the left. And this gives you a couple different options of 2.4 gigahertz and 5 gigahertz guest networks. So I'm just going to focus on 2.4, but 5 is the same. So I have one set up here. It's all blurred out right now. I'll go over here to the right, and I'll hit Enable. And now that has enabled one of my guest networks. I called it uh, WFH Wi-Fi, Work From Home Wi-Fi. If I click on this, it'll open up the config. So we have different options. We have guest network index is three, hide SSD. So I want that to know. I want to be able to see that on the network. Then we have our network name here, authentication method. I'm gonna use WPA2 personal. Encryption method is AES. And the pre-shared key here I have as Wi-Fi pass. Now you wanna have a more secure password for that. Access time, I'll just do unlimited on this. And bandwidth limiter, I'm, gonna, I'm going to say no. And then here is the main thing you need to look at here. It says access intranet, and you want this disabled. So what that will do is that will keep you separate from the other things on your network. And the reason you might want to do that is you don't want your corporate computer spying on your home network. Um, you want to, that to be private. You also don't want your home network to be accessing your corporate network and maybe putting a virus on a corporate computer, things like that. So you're protecting both sides from each other uh, by creating this guest network. So one thing to consider is if you have a printer on your home network and you need to print from your work computer to that printer, you have a couple options. One is you could actually move that printer to the guest network. Another is you could plug that in directly to the computer with like a USB cord or something. So when you have all this set up, you can just hit apply. It will apply the settings. And then you can go to your work computer and you can look for that access point, type in the uh, Wi-Fi password, and then you'll be on a separate network. So I'm going to connect up to this. Now I'll open a terminal. So if I try to ping my router, it pings. And I know on this address here, 192.168.7.2, I have a NAS device, and that doesn't ping. So you could find out the address of one of your other computers and test it to make sure it can't see the other computers. So that's all for this video. If you have any questions about this, please leave them in the comments. If you like this video, please click like. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd appreciate it if you could do that. And thanks for watching. Until next time, goodbye.